breaking news at 11. One person killed in a shooting on the east side. We are still getting details in, but we have learned it happened at an apartment complex. Right over to RTV 6 is Paris Lubell, who is live near Midhoffer and East 30th Street with new details just released from police. Paris? Todd and Erica here on the city's east side, and quite a scene actually developing just in the last few minutes here behind me. Uh, quite a crowd showing up as police continue to move them back, saying they found new evidence. But I'll give you some details here on the city's latest homicide, number 17 for the year. At about 9:45, police say they were called out here for a person shot. They say when they got here, they found a man dead in the back seat of a car. Now, so far, police have been able to determine that that man was somewhere in the complex and then tried to get in the back seat of the car, possibly to have family or friend drive him to the hospital, but unfortunately he didn't make it. Now again, this makes the city's 17th homicide this year, and it's the third this year in this specific area. Now last year, the same area saw about nine homicides and two police-involved shootings. And police tell us they're continuing to investigate, and just here in the last about 20 or 30 minutes, we've had a, a much larger police presence, just more or less because of these crowds that are gathering here. Police saying so far they've been pretty non-violent, uh, a lot of family uh, of this possibly, but... Uh, um, we can see kind of a developing scene. We're going to continue to bring you the latest from out here on the RTV6 app, and we'll have full coverage tomorrow morning on Good Morning Indiana. For now, we're reporting live on the city's east side, Paris LaBelle, RTV6.